If you're looking for a tool to help you update and optimize your item specifics, then Aspect Finder Plus is the tool for you. To use Aspect Finder Plus, select the tool from the home screen. You will have to link your eBay store the first time you use the tool. Upon doing that, you have three options of the choice of a report. You have the download all, the advanced, and the required soon. The download all literally downloads all of your eBay listings and categories and the associated item specifics. The advanced report allows you to select one or several eBay categories. And the required soon allows you to focus purely on the categories that are affected for any eBay mandates. And from time to time, you may see this option grayed out if there are no planned mandates from eBay. Once you've chosen the report you wish to run, click Start Process and you'll receive an email once the report is generated. Once you've received your email, you log back in and click View Report. And you'll then be presented with this screen. This shows you a category level view of the number of listings and item specifics needing attention. There are different headings where you can see the number of item specifics that are required, required soon, preferred or recommended, optional or additional. You can also see the total number of listings, the total units sold and the quantity available. You can sort by any of the different headings as follows. You can click on any of the categories that you see in this view. So this page shows all the listings in the injury straps and supports category and it allows you to look at the item specifics that have previously been populated and the ones that have been found by Optiseller. Now, if you were happy with this listing, you would tick this box here and either send selected or scroll all the way to the right hand side and click send to eBay and that listing would update straight away. The boxes on this page have a status to indicate what is actually needed. If it's green, it's good, it means no attention is required. If it's red, it means that a value is missing, so you should look to populate these values if you can. And if it's been found, this is where the Aspect Finder Plus tool has tried to populate any missing values for you. You will also see the purple boxes on this page, and this is where they do not meet or match the eBay drop-down value. You should look to change these where possible and not to seller makes recommendations underneath any purple box values for you to review. Once you've finished making any changes on this page, you have a few different options on how to send the data to eBay. You can tick the box to select all and send selected to eBay. You can do it on a one by one basis or you can revise all on eBay by clicking this button or you have a choice of a few different export formats. If you're using a third party provider, um, this, this may be very helpful for you. You may wonder what these stars are at the top of the item specific headings. This is the buyer demand data. And these correlate to the number of searches and filters customers are using in eBay search. So it's well worth prioritizing the ones with the stars at the top of the headings when you're optimizing your item specifics. Once you've finished in this particular category and get back to the previous screen, you click the view previous reports button. It then takes you back to the category level view. If you wanted to download all the data for your categories and listings, you would have the option here in the top right through various different formats. And then you would choose one and then click download all data. And then that would generate in the bottom left corner of your screen. 